Hi YouTube. I've this. Hi YouTube, Swedish. Hi YouTube, the Swedish tourist in America is back again with another disturbing find. This time, though, let's just say it's not your typical paranormal finding. I found a real, a real evidence of a dragon on U.S. soil. It all started when I went to this house. I noticed the olden day style photography on the wall. And then I came over here and I was, I was examining everything, you know, and then I noticed this closet. It was exactly as it is right now. Shut but opened a crack and it kind of piqued my interest that way a ghost hunter might feel when he suddenly feels like oh wow maybe there is something to this maybe maybe there are ghosts maybe I'm about to stumble onto something great but I didn't find a ghost what I found was a real life dragon as you can see it kind of resembles a, uh, well, I would describe it as the kind of dragon that the musician Pink would invite to go on tour with her for one of her upcoming tours. This dragon is... Well, oh my. This dragon doesn't seem very dangerous, but... But how can you trust a dragon? Honestly, I think that Pink might have been making the right decision in not inviting this Pink Dragoon along with her for her tour. Just because it it could be vicious. Not saying that it is, but if it was, how, how would she be able to stop the dragon while performing You and Your Hand tonight to all of her fans? I don't know, and I don't think I was meant to know, but I am telling you, you got to open your eyes because the paranormal is out there lurking behind closets all over America. There are dragons, dragon skins, dragon, dragons which lie dormant on American soil. Keep an eye out guys and uh, stay safe. Be sure to wear your chainmail armor when visiting houses that you aren't familiar with because it is the best defense against the dragon's teeth. Goodbye YouTube!